Welcome to my channel Health for You. Acute migraine treatment during pregnancy medications for migraines. If you are pregnant or planning to get pregnant soon, your doctor will generally advise you to stay off medications unless they are absolutely needed. Together you will have to weigh the potential effects of a drug on your unborn baby. In some cases, our decision will need to be made based on scant or inconclusive research into a particular drug. Many of the anti-migraine medications to treat or prevent migraine headache and its symptoms should be avoided during pregnancy. That's because they have been linked to birth defects in babies. Other medications are associated with pregnancy complications. For instance, some have been associated with bleeding, miscarriage, or intrauterine growth restriction IUGR, a condition in which the uterus and fetus don't grow normally. Acute Migraine Treatment Acute treatment aims to stop a migraine attack after its first signs appear. Pain Relievers Also called analgesics may help ease the instant pain of migraines. These general pain relieving drugs though are not specific to the migraine pain pathway. Estaminophen is generally considered low risk during pregnancy. non anti-inflammatory drugs NSAIDs including aspirin may carry a risk of bleeding and miscarriage if taken near the time of conception. There, there is also a possible risk of blood pressure complications in the baby if they are taken in the third trimester. Aspirin taken near delivery may lead to excess blood loss in mothers during birth. Most NAIDS including ibuprofen sold over the counter under, under the brand Names Advil and Motrin and Naproxen, sold as LV and other brands, don't have enough controlled human research studies to assess all their risk in pregnancy. Narcotic pain relievers should generally be avoided. There is a dual risk of addiction in both mothers and baby if they are used for prolonged periods of time. Arguta Mines work specially for migraine pain, but doctors advise against taking these drugs during pregnancy. They carry a risk of birth defects, especially if taken in the first trimester. These drugs may also stimulate labor construction and premature birth. Triptans work specially on the migraine pain pathway. Tip trends are not known to cause birth defects, but most research to date has focused on animals, not humans. In 2008, the Journal of the American Medical Association renewed its warning against combining triptans with two common classes of antidepressant selective Serotonin Reuptake Inhibitors SSRIS Selective Serotonin Noripepine Ferrine 
reuptake inhibitors SNRIS. The combination carries the risk of a life-threatening condition called serotonin syndrome. Other medications may be prescribed for relief of specific symptoms of a migraine during pregnancy. For instance, Antimatics help soothe the vomiting and nausea that can accompany a migraine. But many of the drugs typically used for migraine have not been adequately studied in pregnancy. So their safety or risk to the fetus has not been determined.